Hey guys, how you doing? My name is Echo and welcome to the second unboxing video on my channel today. Today for you in this video, you have the privilege of a Loot Crate unboxing video. This month is August 2015 and the theme behind this month was villains. So this was Villains 2 because if I can remember, they did Villains late 2014, early 2015. Now if you guys do enjoy this and you would like to see more, be sure to thumbs it up because I absolutely love doing the unboxing. Now, if you are new to my channel, Loot Crate is a monthly subscription. It's full of surprises based on a specific theme. This theme was Villains. If you guys want to grab your own, check out the links in description and use the code ECHO for 10% off. Nonetheless, I'm curious what's inside this. It is Villains. Last time was such a great success, which is why they did it again. Now, I'm yet to break the seal. Um, I'm trying not to show you guys my address underneath, but the seal is down there. You can just about see it. I'm going to have the satisfactory of opening this now, and you guys will get the first preview. It literally is like Christmas every single month because you have no idea what's inside. So I have my, my trusty knife, which was protected by this. Kids, be knives are dangerous. So let's just quickly open this. Oh my god, it's not... There we go. Alright, now it's open. You guys are going to have this first sneak preview. Uh, and let me know in the comments section what caught your eyes first. Um, and hopefully it's not something pretty obvious. Anyway, this month's box is pretty heavy compared to the previous one. So I'm pretty much sure we're going to have some great loot. So you guys get to see the first preview. Let me know in the comments section what stood out to you in great detail. But again, the box is pretty heavy compared to the pre... Oh, okay. Marvel. Marvel, 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 Marvel. Marvel stood out pretty well. Now, what I absolutely love what Loot Crate do is what they do with the, the box designs. As you guys can see there, it looks like the Joker is up to no good uh, here. You guys can just about see him. And I can't really see it in great detail. But it looks like the Joker's workshop. He looks like he's conjuring up some huge guy there. Um, but before I show you guys the Marvel, I'm going to work on the other things because I'm pretty sure... The main addition in today's box is going to be the Marvel figurine. And something else that stood out to me is this. This is, it's got, it got like the haha, -ha, so obviously it's linked to the Joker. It says here, the DC Comics, the Joker painted wooden figure. Now on the box, you can see, I think that's, uh, you've got the Joker, you've got Batman, you've got the combination of Batman. Oh, okay, so the other two are Batman and Superman. All right, then, that's a nice addition. So let's open this and see what we do have to deal with. Um, there's two heads in here, so I'm kind of, Oh, we do. Look, we've got this head. And we've also got one attached to the character. So let's open this real quick. Um, as you guys can see here, this is the character... Oh, let's fix his head. This, oops, let's fix his head. This is the character we are dealing with right now. Um, as you guys can see, and he's got a second head there. Uh, but it's, you can literally dismantle it by the looks. Yeah, you can literally take apart the whole figurine if you really wanted to. You guys can see a little bit of the, the little um, connections and stuff. Now he only has one arm, as you guys can see there. Um, I kind of broke him. Ugh, let's switch head. Oh, okay, now he has no head. Let's switch heads real quick. I don't know the difference between heads. Let me try and figure this out for you guys. Uh, the difference is this one's kind of got like a scary-eyed one. You guys can see the eyes are different. Um, so yeah, that's the first thing we did get inside, and I, I did notice that. It's a nice little touch. It is a nice little touch, and it's pretty heavy, so this could be the reason why the box was heavy as well. So let's move that to the side. The next thing I did notice was this. This is, if I can read it, it says, Warning to avoid danger of suffocation, keep away from babies and children, and dispose of bag immediately. I'm going to do exactly what it says. I'm going to dispose of the bag immediately. That's what it says. You guys can just about see it. No, you can't see it. It just says, dispose of the bag. It sounds like it is. Is it a bag? Is it a, it's not a t-shirt. It's definitely not a t-shirt. It might, is it an apron? It's an apron. It's an apron. It's an apron. All right, let's just quickly get this out. It's an apron. I'm going to try and open a few guys here. We have here. Let's see what this is. Now, that was stenciled on to, to protect it. Can you guys see this correctly here? I hope so. It just says on top, Loz, Polos, uh, Hernando, Herman, Hermandos, Hermandos, and it's like of chickens, and it's an apron, it is, it is, it's an apron, it looks so funky, fresh, I'm ready for the kitchen, let's go, let's go and bake some chickens, I mean, let's not go and bake some chickens, let's, this is pretty cool, I'm not gonna lie, I like this addition, I, rec I reckon I can rock this pretty well, just saying, 
<laughs> right then, so that was a, that is the most random thing I've ever been sent by Loot Crate or any subscription. It's a nice touch, I'm not gonna lie. Let's just quickly throw the stuff out the way. All right, I'm gonna sit here in my apron. Uh, we've got the marble thing here. Before I focus on the marble thing, we have something here which says, it says Captain America. Now I do like Captain America, but I'm not the biggest Captain America fan. And I'm not entirely sure what this is. It looks like an octopus. I really couldn't tell you. It just says on the box, Marvel Studios, the Captain America, the first Avengers. Now it says EFX on it as well, as you guys can see there. On the back, the EFX logo. I don't know entirely know what it's for. I couldn't, I generally could not tell you guys. Um, so what I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna burst my way open on the side. Um, and I, I, it's, I don't know if this is for like, I think is it for a tie or something? Or for a belt? Um, I thought it was for um, handcuffs because of these inside. But it generally doesn't look like it is for handcuffs at all. Um, but this is what we do have to deal with. This creature, I don't know, he looks like something from Star Wars. He really does look like... I, I, maybe someone can let me know in the comments section. This is the only one I generally couldn't tell you guys what is inside. I do like Marvel, but this one's just baffled me. Maybe it's from the latest movie. If it has, I haven't seen it. So that could possibly be why as well. So yeah, it's a nice touch. It does say this is for... Uh, this is not a toy. This product is intended for adults only. All right then, it's intended for adults only. Good job, and I'm, I'm an adult. I'm an adult stuck, I'm a child stuck in an adult's body. All right, so we also, every single month, get one of these. Uh, this is the button that you get. You can put these on anything you want. There's a whole bunch. Every single Loot Crate you get will get one of these. And this one just says, Loot Crate, August 2015, Villains 2. Um, and then something inside here before we open the Marvel edition is this. We've got the beautiful Joker rocking on as evil. And on the bottom it says, we, we love it. We love to hate or something like that. I don't entirely show, but it just says something on the back, on the bottom. I can't entirely read it properly. It just says something. Uh, and this, to me, is this city deserves it. It's. I think it's a. I, th I think it's like a little comic. I think it is. No, no, no. This is like the the whole how they come about with the specific type of theme. Um, what they've been working on, what to expect, and stuff like that. I like this. It's a nice little. It's a nice little addition to check out how the theme comes about and stuff like that. Aha, uh -huh, it says in here, Captain America Hydra Pin, EFX collectible, worn by followers of the Red Skull of those who pledged the reliance to the Hydra. This authentic handcrafted replica was manufactured using the original uh, digital files of the actual screen prop. Well, there you go, as you guys can see there, I learned something new about this because I really didn't know what it was. Um, but yes, now I do, I guess. Um, and last but not least in today's video, we have Marvel. Now this is the Marvel thing we got. Now it says, backstage pass included a division of class imports not intended for age 12 or under, made in China. It says Venom, Venom 16 molded mug. Now this is probably the reason why the box is heavy. It's a mug. It is a mug. That makes a lot more sense this month. It's a mug. All right, so let's crack this open. That's now been cracked open. I'm gonna quickly open this and see what's inside of it. It's a mug. It's just, it's generally a mug. I'm just gonna, it's like, it's like, it's got the, the styrofoam there. So I'm gonna quickly remove this. It's not broken, that's a good thing. It's been transported. Oh my God, that is, oh my God, look at that. Look at that. That is incredible. That is amazing. Look at that mug. It is. I don't really drink tea or coffee or anything like that. Sometimes hot chocolate. But that is amazing. No wonder the box was heavy. No wonder everyone's told me that this month they were they were super happy with Loot Crate. Um, wow. Loot Crate, you did very, 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 very well. That was a nice addition. Look at that. That is pretty epic if you ask me. That is awesome. It's a Venom mug. It's a Venom mug. A Venom mug. Wow. Well, Loot Crate, you outdone yourself this month, definitely did. It was such an improvement from last month. I'm gonna try and make sure I don't get this up wrong. I'm gonna keep this in, box, in the box for now. Um, but there we go, guys. That is this month's Loot Crate subscription. You never know what you're ever gonna get. And that was a big, pleasant surprise. I really didn't expect that. The whole conclusion of the box being heavy was then understood. So I'm hoping you guys did enjoy this. As always, if you did, be sure to thumbs it up. If you would like to grab your own, the links are in the description. A bit echo. Have a great day, and as always, I'll catch you next time. Bye!